Hi, this is Ashley back with another reading, and this reading is going to be on whether Nicki Minaj's new single that she might drop tomorrow uh, will be successful, okay? So, um, I personally don't really care about the charts like that because most of Nicki Minaj's songs um, that she drops that I really, really like, that I listen to on a daily basis are not were not on billboard or weren't singles you know and i've actually liked that with a lot of artists like with j cole um you know nikki rihanna a lot of their songs that i do like were never really quote unquote hits so to me um i really don't care i'm just doing it for you guys because a lot of you guys have asked me to do a reading on it so she's going live tonight and the single is probably going to drop, drop at, you know, 12 o'clock, um, you know, midnight, which is technically tomorrow. And also J. Cole is going to drop. I already did a reading on him last week. Um, so we're going to see if this um, single is going to be successful. Before we get into anything, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you turn on post notifications. This reading is strictly for entertainment purposes only. So we're going to start off with this. Will Nicki Minaj's single that she may drop tomorrow, will the single be successful? Will it chart? That she may drop tomorrow, will it be successful? Will it chart? Honestly, it's almost like she's kind of still indecisive on whether she really wants to drop the song or not, okay? We have the Seven of Swords. This talks about sneakiness, stuff happening behind the scenes, okay? So it's almost like she's trying to be cautious. Like, should I drop it and just, you know, basically uh, let whatever happens? Or should I kind of be strategic um, you know, pretend like I'm dropping and not drop anything, you know, because we see what they're kind of doing is very obvious. Okay. We got the star card. This talks about being hopeful. So, so Nikki thinks that, um, you know, the song will be successful. She thinks that the song, if she drops the song, it will be successful. Okay. But there's a lot of sneakiness happening behind the scenes. The justice card is here in reverse. This talks about unfairness doing wrong by somebody so they are plotting so it's almost like she's still indecisive of whether she really wants to drop because she knows that people are plotting but she thinks that she will prevail this talks about being hopeful for the future okay and then we have the death card this talks about a new beginning okay this also talks about ending of something so it's almost like coming into this era Nikki's going to do a lot of things differently, okay? It's no more of the shenanigans that happened in the queen era. It's almost like she's going to move different this time, okay? And then we have the Ten of Cups, okay? And this talks about, you know, building a foundation, starting from scratch. So it's almost like she feels like she's kind of starting over, okay? Um, that is a new beginning. She's going to do things differently. So it looks like she's still kind of indecisive of whether she really wants to drop, okay, the song because she knows that people are plotting also, but she is hopeful that um, even though people are plotting against her, that she still will prevail, okay, that she's still going to end up on top, okay. So what else? Well, Nikki's song that she might drop tomorrow, will it... Will it be successful? Will it be successful? Mm. I'm getting a lot of manipulation. I'm being honest with you guys. I'm getting a lot of... Um, you know, buffoonery happening. You know, the magician card is here. This talks about manipulation, people doing certain things behind the scenes, okay? It looks like they're going to try to pull all stops, okay? 
you know, we have the emperor card here. This talks about an authority figure, you know, somebody with power um, doing things, being sketchy, being sneaky, okay? We also have the six of cups talks about not really getting a lot of help, okay? Nikki needs um, a machine behind her and kind of from the outside looking in, it really looks like she's doing all of her promotion, okay? That's her car that she's in. You know, she got Kenneth, she got um, Eric and Tay filming her. You know, he did her hair. It looks like she's kind of doing all the promotion by herself, like Universal barely helping, okay? They're just there to kind of take credit. Um, I see them under her comments, you know, the Instagram, um, under her Instagram, but it looks like they're not really helping her, okay? Because as a label, you're supposed to help with promotion, marketing, and... It looks like she's doing everything by herself. That's her That's her car. She bought that in 2019, okay? That's not a rental. That's her car, you know? And, you know, Eric and Tay filming her, she should have a whole camera crew. You know, she should make little videos. She should have people that backing behind her, okay? And it looks like she's kind of doing her own promotion, okay? So she's not really getting a lot of help. It looks like... You know, they're going to try to stop the success of the song. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. It looks like a lot of manipulation is going to be trying to happen. Okay, the magician card is here. Let's see. Well, the song, let's go, let's put these cards back. I want to see if the song could possibly go number one. Okay, personally, if the song is good, I'm going to listen to it no matter what, as long as it doesn't sound like Megatron. I didn't like Megatron. I don't care what nobody says. And I did not like um, no frauds like that, okay? Yikes was fire. If we get Yikes 2.0, I can rock with that. Chungly or Lookin' ASS, I like songs like that. I don't like Megatron, Okay. So, let's see. Well, can the song go, you know, number one? Can the song possibly go number one? If Nicki Minaj drops tomorrow, could the song possibly go number one? Yeah, I'm being honest with you. They're they're gonna come hard. Is it's gonna be very hard for Nikki to really um to pull this off, to pull a number one record, even if we all buy it. Um, you know, even if it does a hundred K first week and we all stream it, it looks like they're gonna be pulling all the stops. I'm not even gonna lie. Okay. All we can do is be hopeful that the Hermit card, this talks about secrets. This talks about hidden motives, secrets. The Fool card, this talks about kind of being naive, um, taking a risk, being a risk taker, okay? Um, the King of Swords, um, this talks about somebody um, that kind of does underhanded things, okay? This card also speaks about manipulation. And then we got the Five of Swords. This talks about being a backstabber somebody not um somebody that nikki's not able to trust somebody being a backstabber doing underhanded things okay now let's see if the song could go number one if no strings will be pulled okay could Nicki minaj's new song tomorrow possibly go number one if strings aren't being pulled if strings aren't being pulled Yeah, I can see it going number one if people are not, you know, being manipulative, okay? Because the Queen of Pentacles is here. This talks about focusing on oneself. This talks about success. This talks about moving forward, okay? We also have the Temperance card. This talks about choices, making a decision. This talks about being patient, time. So it looks like if strings aren't being pulled, if, you know, Nikki has the right team, it could go number one, okay? The Queen of Pentacles is here. This talks about success, okay? 
Um, and then we have the Queen of Swords. This talks about kind of pulling, putting up a fight, okay? Um, you know, being stern, okay? Somebody that's stern, that's about their business. And that's definitely Nikki's energy. But, you know, she has to have that help, that push. It can't just be the fans doing all the work. And right now, from the outside looking in, it looks like Nikki's really doing all the work, okay? She's doing all the promotion. Universal is just commenting under Instagram posts, like, are you going to help? Republic Records is just commenting under posts. Are you going to help? Young Money, what are you doing? You know what I'm saying? It looks like it can happen if, you know, she has, if she's strategic, if she has the right team, um, if she makes people watch the numbers, make sure nothing sketchy is happening, it could be possible because the Queen of Pentacles talks about success, okay? Um, so it does look like it could be, um, you know, a successful outcome if, you know, she does the right things and she has the team behind her. And the a page of Pentacles, this talks about creativity. This talks about, um, you know, arts. This talks about music. This talks about, you know, um, somebody that's very creative that can put together magic, okay? Let's see. How would, if she releases a song, how would people receive it? If Nicki Minaj releases a song tomorrow, how will people receive the record? It's going, oh, it's going to be very beneficial for her. A lot of people are going to like this record. There's going to be a few people, you know, trying to be haters. But the Ace of Pentacles, this talks about opportunities, okay? I think this has a lot to do with um a chanel deal i think that if she mentions chanel or if she wears chanel in the video or in um you know a promotion picture or something like that this can help her get an opportunity with chanel the same thing with chung lee and fendi okay so it's definitely gonna help her with opportunities okay um the knight of swords this talks about fighting um, um, you know, challenging oneself, you know, putting up a fight, going out strong, okay? So it looks like um, the record will be received well by a lot of people. There's going to be a few people that are not going to um, obviously give Nikki her props. You know, people are going to, you know, nitpick certain things, but it's going to give her a, a lot of opportunities, especially if she referenced certain brands. You saw what happened with Crocs. The sales went up. So it's going to give her an opportunity, okay? So if you guys like this reading, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you turn on post notifications. This reading was strictly for entertainment purposes only. And I hope you have a great day.